Hello, everybody, and welcome to another Death Reacts. Before we get started with today's reaction, I wanted to read this comment out loud because of, well, how happy it kind of made me. So, and of course, a guy says, if you want something more special, react to Harmasar, excuse me if I'm butchering this, by the way, Harmasar Vaslu, uh, Vaslui? 1475, this is a Romanian, actually uh, Moldavian, uh, but they're still Romanians, a uh, folk metal band. Folk metal, folk metal. So like, um, I'm, I'm sitting here thinking to myself, folk metal must be like heavy metal, like banjo fucking action, right? That was my fucking thinking. So I was thinking about it for like, um, for, for uh, like all day today. I was thinking about this. Like, how the fuck would that even sound like? Uh, the song is about a, ba is about a battle of uh, Vasoli, hence the name of the song, um, uh, where the Ottomans attacked Vasoli with um, 120,000 troops and still uh, Mol Moldavia won with uh, 40,000. That's, that's really fucking cool. How, you know, someone with lower numbers managed to win a fucking battle. Um, you know, so... Stephen the Great. No, it was that great, but uh, Stephen the Great, who was the who's uh, reigning over Moldovia at the time, had forty two battles, lost just five, and he is also national hero today in Romania, just like Vlad the Impaler. You probably uh, you won't probably understand the lyrics as they are in Romanian, which is completely fine. You know, I am okay. Like like I said in this actually reaction. Uh, when I was reacting to Mayhem, uh, what was it? It was uh, Death Crunch or some shit like that? It was, uh, yeah, it was Death Crunch. When I was reacting to Death Crunch, I was sitting here fucking, like, complaining about how I was, like, unable to really hear the lyrics, hear the gargling that was going on, because it was supposed to be, from my understanding, some kind of English. <clears throat> and, you know, I've already said in this video, or in that video, that I listened to Rammstein, so, you know, it's it's not that, you know, fucking, I, I don't just specifically listen to bands that speak only English, because Rammstein does speak a little English within their song, but they're mostly German, so, so yeah. Uh, you probably won't understand the lyrics, of course, but it's a cool song. I don't think anybody on YouTube has ever reacted to them. Well, this would be a very first time. Uh, by the way, you are musically educated. I really am not. <laughs> if you want to, if you want to know where I get most of my musical education, as you say, it's from Scotty over on SiriusXM. So big, huge shout out to Scotty, uh, Scott Ian, or whatever his fucking name is. I can't fucking remember. He does, he does the, um, the, um, the, um, what's it called? The, the Metal History fucking show over there on Sirius XM Liquid Metal. But a uh, huge shout out to him, uh, whatever his fucking name is. And thank you, Andre, uh, Andre um, Delcia. I'm, I po really apologize if I'm fucking pronouncing this fucking wrong, but, you know, it's, it's fine. So, here we go. Uh, Harmasar uh, Baslui. 1475, it's about a battle. It's about a battle that was won with 40,000 troops against 120,000 troops. So that's, that's a lot. Here we fucking go. What the f- Look. Okay. <laughs> I'm not used, well, I should say, I should be used to, like, sort of, like, these sort of kind of intros that are, like, not metal, because I listen to Metallica, I listen to Slipknot, I listen to fucking Gojira, you know, um, and some of those songs, or at least with Metallica, they, they fucking uh, just released an album, S&M 2, is all fucking orchestra, so I should be already used to, like, Something like this. This just caught me off guard. I don't know what I was expecting. Wow. I, 
I don't know how to explain it. I'm hooked. Like I'm hooked in. I I don't I don't exactly know how to really explain what I'm feeling right now. Um other than to say that I love the vocals. I absolutely love it. His the whoever is singing, his voice is so mesmerizing. It's it's like I'm fucking hooked in and I already know the context. Like this is supposed to be like about this battle. So I'm hooked in. I can literally see the fucking battle. So or at least the battle forming within my mind. I could see like how the song can, you know, it, it's sort of forming in my mind if you understand what uh what I'm talking about. So, let's just keep going. <laughs> Ooh, I like the ground too. You know, those fucking... I have to. I'm sorry. I'm a fucking metalhead. You cannot fucking say hey or, you know, hi or whatever the fuck and not fucking go hi, you know, shit like that. So fucking Jesus Christ, sue me. It's, mm, it's things like this that makes me feel I love it. You know, this is the reason, and that's actually the reason why I got so hooked into falling in reverse. Um, going back to, you know, when I actually like got hooked and actually became a big fucking fan. If I if I listened to maybe a couple more songs from this band, maybe I would get hooked. But right now, this song fucking hooks me in so fucking bad that if if this was uh, if this was an opener at some fucking concert, I would be fucking happy I saw them. Like, I would be immensely fucking in a trance listening to these guys. I need to see, like, a live video. I think if I would, were to ever react to this band again, it would have to be a live video. I need to know, like, how fucking crazy the crowd gets with, with these guys. This is fucking crazy. Like, th this would be the second band that I would, that I, uh, nor oh, well, I wouldn't say normally, but that I listen to intensely um, that I can't fucking understand a goddamn word they're saying. And, you know, at the same time, that's okay. That's, and it, it, it really is. Well, technically, it would be the third band, because I do listen to a, a Spanish band. God, what are they called? Uh, I can't remember their name. But, um, I can't remember the fucking song from them either. But, you know, again, going back to Rammstein, you know, the voice is so mesmerizing that it fucking, it, tr it, it, it makes you go into this fucking trance. And then the music is so fucking good as well. You know, I don't even care that there's fucking flutes playing in the background because, god damn it, I'm fucking moving. And that's what I love about music. I've said this so many times before. I love moving. And if it fucking moves me, then you fucking better know I love it. So. This is a five minute song, too. It's gonna be here all night.
See, here, here's what I like about that bit. That would, in a normal heavy metal circumstance, the bit that was played by the flute would have done so perfect if it was an electric guitar. But the fact that it was a fucking flute that did it is so fucking impressive to me. At least, you know, music-wise, I feel the fucking emotion in this song. You know, I feel that if this, if, if that bit was done very well on a guitar, I would be so hooked on this fucking band immediately. You know, I'm not, I'm not so sure about the folk metal part. Like, I understand, you know, its roots and stuff like that. I understand they do a bunch of fucking crazy shit as well. The flute, it, it's kind of off-putting but at the same time it adds to to the experience of folk metal and i've it, it's enjoyable so you know let's just keep going you know I do. I love it. I, I I cannot say this anymore. I fucking or I can't. I can't just not say. It. Or well, I love it. Look, I I do. I fucking do. It's a great song. It's it's so fucking good. And I got like another fucking minute and a half too. So holy shit, it's a great fucking song. I am like I'm so fucking into this song, like. You have no fucking idea. You sent me a fucking banger, dude. You really fucking did. I was so fucking into that. If it went on for like another two minutes, I would have been fine. Like another two minutes of instrumental. I would have been so fucking fine with that. Fuck you flies. So, yeah. Like surrounded by flies right now. I do apologize. Smacking around or waving around. I'm trying to wave these fucking flies away. But, um... But you sent me, like I said, you sent me a fucking banger, dude. I'm, I'm very, very impressed with this fucking music. You know, 
generally i would not listen to folk metal like i don't i barely do listen to folk metal as it is you know if it was on sirius xm fuck yeah i'd listen to it like anything that is put on sirius xm well almost everything um i do listen to so you know folk metal is definitely something that is very very uh overlooked and uh you know it's a shame because you know you miss out on fucking great songs such as this fucking song that you know is about a fucking battle um about an underdog that fucking you know um that was able to fucking fend off and 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 beat and and, and beat their opponent that that was very much overpowered so you know it's it's whatever, you know. At the end of the day, it's 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 a good song. I like it. I I enjoyed it for what it was. Um I will most likely listen to more of this. And I can't believe I have to say this. I said music that I would I would not be into. But you know what? It's fine. It's fine. I do enjoy um listening to to music that, you know, does surprise me that does take me in this really fucking surprised me like the fucking intro bit with the fucking flutes and shit uh really fucking surprised me i was i was genuinely surprised that throughout the song i was really enjoying myself if i was to listen to this like front to back without ha without pausing i would i would be fucking banging to this this is a but this is a this is a banger i fucking enjoy it so so yeah very 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 good uh, my rating would be a nine out of ten. Um, <laughs> my death, my uh, my death rating is going to be nine out of ten. Um, and I, let me t let me tell you why. Um, like I said before, the flute to me felt a little off putting. Like it felt normal to have this flute, but in times it felt off putting. It felt distracting a couple times uh, with the flute. It felt uh, at least to me, that the flute could have definitely been replaced with the guitar would have sounded much, much better. But then, you know, probably would have taken away from the folk metal um, kind of part of the song, which is very understandable. But um, you know, for what it was, um, again, it, it's it's a nine nine out of ten, and that's the best you're going to get from me. Um, it's it's no Gojira, it's no Slipknot for sure. You know, <clears throat> but. Um, Shit, you know, fucking finding new music like this uh, that really grabs my attention, that really makes me want to fucking go out and fucking mosh like this. I would fucking go out and mosh this fucking song. I'm not joking. I would. So, more songs like this, you know, I'll listen to all day, every day. And if we get to, to the point where I'm just listening to this fucking music, and if I am listening to this fucking music for the rest of my life, I would probably be happy, but not satisfied. Because uh, I still need my Slipknot, still need my Gojira, still need Sabaton, uh, you know, Metallica and shit like that. So, so you know, at the same time, um, oh, speaking of Sabaton, that's what I was feeling the entire... In the, uh, the entire time I was listening to this song, I was feeling more Sabaton than anything else. I don't know why. I think it's mostly because Sabaton is more uh, story orientated and more war focused than in, like than any other band that I listen to. Maybe uh, Slayer or some shit like that. I don't know about Slayer or whatever. Cause I do listen to a couple of their songs, but um, you know, at the same time, it's like whatever like their songs are very enjoyable to listen to so you know especially when it comes to sabaton because their stories or their songs are more story uh you know story um story wise at least uh, orientated is the word i was looking for. story orientated and uh more focused on the battle or or war or that that sort of stuff, which is okay, you know. I am fine with that. I, I I'm not complaining, but at the same time, it's 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 an alright song. So that's that's gonna be that. 
Thank you for watching, and a huge shout out again to um, whatever your name was, um, on on and Andre, whatever fuck on, um, yeah, Andre, your name is. But anyways, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you enjoyed my reaction. If you got any other songs you want me to react to, feel free to hit me up or uh, post a comment down below. I'll get to it whenever, um, whenever I can. Um, so yeah, again. Thank you for watching. If you're new, hit the subscribe button. And as always, I will see you guys next time. All right? All right. Peace out. Bye-bye.